What is going on guys? Grave here. Welcome back to Battlefield 5. Last night, DICE announced that the first new map in in kind of the roadmap going ahead, which was going to be Al Sundan, will most likely be delayed. They said there's a game-breaking bug involving Conquest within this uh, map, and that they're most likely going to have to delay that map being released. I'm not sure if that's going to change anything with the June 27th release of the new chapter. They did not really detail that. I'm hoping they can get this fixed before uh, it's supposed to be released, but they were kind of hinting that it's most likely going to be delayed, or the map at least is going to be delayed. Now this is frustrating because a lot of people were kind of getting to see, or beginning I guess, to see what was going on with Battlefield 5. I thought, I, I thought personally that the game was getting uh, kind of put in a better state. There were still so, uh, some glaring issues, but we do have a road map. There's a lot of things coming to the game. Operation Metro is coming back to the game in the fall. Uh, of course, the Pacific uh, DLC is going to be coming out, so a lot of people were interested in the U.S. being put into the game. So I, I think there was a lot of upside to the game. And now with something like this, the very first map within your roadmap DLC idea is kind of messed up and you're having to delay it. It's going to put people off of the game again, in my opinion. I mean, the game, when it first came out, had a lot of, a lot of turmoil. It kind of been up and down since then. They've had some players come back, some players leave. But the player base, let's just be honest, is not where it used to be for Battlefield. Battlefield player base has never been absolutely massive. But I don't think it's just Battlefield 5. I can go back to Battlefield 3, Battlefield 4, Hardline, Battlefield 1. They all had some game-breaking bugs throughout their life cycles that really turned players off. And I think kind of a lot of people have stepped away from the franchise in general since some of those earlier releases. But I can even go back. I mean, I'm a long-time Battlefield player. I can even go back to Bad Company 1, Bad Company 2, uh... 1942, Battlefield 2, uh, Battlefield Vietnam. Some of those games had game-breaking bugs as well, but to me they're not as often and not as many as they have been since I would say probably Battlefield 3 was released and onward. Hopefully they can get this fixed quickly. Hopefully they will not have to delay it, but just in case you don't see that map come up when it's supposed to kind of in that you know release time, you'll know why. Hopefully they'll get this fixed. Hopefully they can get things going in the right direction moving forward or they could have a big issue on their hands anyway guys leave me a comment let me know what you think and of course if you'd like to hit the like if you haven't subscribed yet please do so and i'll catch you next time peace